All right, welcome back. Hey, so a lot of people do ask me, where am I putting my crypto I mine that I'm holding? Because I don't really sell any of it. Uh, I'm mining Ethereum, getting paid out in Bitcoin because Bitcoin is king. Everyone is recognizing Bitcoin is replacing real estate. It's a uh, digital gold. It's a uh, digital real estate. Ethereum and all that crap, you can mine it, but I am not holding Ethereum, boy. With that merge coming up, woo, I think that thing's going to tank and destroy the internet. I don't know. I'm not the internet. Might, it's going to hurt Ethereum because I don't get warm, happy vibes from the dev team or the people supposedly leading that effort. It just, I don't know. It's starting to seem like they're on their last days of being in the top two of uh, the crypto holdings. I think there's going to be some uh, challengers taking their spot. Yeah, based on scalability, network fees, etc. Anyway, enough about that. So where do I put my crypto? I use Voyager for some of my holdings. I'll mine to my wallets on Voyager. Why? Because you get paid monthly and dividends. I call them dividends, but it's rewards, interest. And if you actually hold the Voyager token, which is their own token, it boosts your monthly take home on the crypto you hold. So you get certain percentages of certain coins you hold. And depending on what you hold, you can make a few hundred bucks a month in passive income by making interest. Of course, it's all tax reportable. But again, it's you're, they're giving you money to put your stuff there, right? Is there risk? There's risk with anything. There are risk with anything. You put your money in a cold wallet, uh, Nano, which I do as well, but you may lose that. Again, your tokens, all that stuff. You got to do your own research. I'm just pointing this out as a way to get some free Bitcoin and then do what I'm kind of doing and kind of grow in your uh, stack of Satoshis, right? By referring people to Voyager. I've used it for a year now. It's great. I've made uh, quite a lot of money each month and just interest on the crypto I am holding. I'm just saying that. That is the truth. Not shilling anything, just pushing this out there because this is one of those offers where we both win. So for me, I'm going to get $60 in Voyager tokens, which is ticker symbol VGX. And what does that mean? It just means it bumps uh, a $10 boost that I earn, or it just gives me a boost in the number of Voyager tokens I hold. The more Voyager tokens are hold, the level of... Uh, of a loyalty program rewards you get. So right now I think I'm an adventurer. I own over a little 500 Voyager tokens. Anyway, so what do you get? So if I refer a friend, you guys are my internet friends. Group hug, group hug. Okay. Uh, there's a referral code below in the description and the pinned comment. When I refer a friend from me, I'm going to receive $50 in Voyager tokens plus a $10 Ten dollar, what's a dollar? Plus a ten dollar Voyager boost, so I'm going to earn a total of sixty dollars in Voyager. That's what I'm getting. You being my best internet friend, you're going to receive fifty dollars in Bitcoin. Now you'll receive that. You'll receive that bonus once you have completed a deposit and trade of one hundred dollars or more, and you'll see the chart below for more details. So you win, and then I win. You know, I prefer to have Bitcoin myself as a reward but once you get in the voyager then you can actually go and do this as well say hey friends and family why don't you sign up if you want to put 100 bucks in and deposit and trade on voyager you'll get your 50 bucks in bitcoin added to your account read the details guys don't listen to some uh youtube idiot like me i just put put putting this out there so people know what's available ways to make extra income on the crypto you are mining uh, why you wait for the bear market to end and the uh, bull market to continue and probably uh, what year are we in 2022 this is June 2022 I see the uh, next bull market probably end of 2024 I think the programming cycles for the ups and downs for Bitcoin I think they're put into the software it just seems to be a repetitive pattern so I'm thinking end of 2024 is going to be the next mega shot of Bitcoin. I'm not talking about these damn altcoins. Be weary of altcoins, guys. Even Ethereum. That's to me is an altcoin because that's a branch off of ETC, Ethereum Classic, right? I get nervous on altcoins because they always follow the leader anyway. They follow Bitcoin. So I don't know. And also look at Luna. Altcoins can go to zero. They can get delisted from an exchange. Then you're you're left holding nothing, literally nothing. Uh, so you got to watch altcoins. I want Satoshis. I want Bitcoin. And I mine Ethereum and I get paid out in Bitcoin on two miners right now. My CPUs are mining all the coins in Ghost Rider and I'm getting paid out in Bitcoin. I just 
got into crypto because of Bitcoin, not Ethereum. I don't like Ethereum. I don't like the high network fees. I know that pays the miners, but again, it's a love-hate relationship. Watching the Ethereum dev meetings, they don't give me a warm fuzzy about what, what you know, that they know what they're doing. And uh, that to me, I'm a software dude. I steer clear of that. These guys are just have an aimless leadership and it's not looking good. Uh, yeah, I think that merge is really going to hurt Ethereum. So let's go on, mainly because of fees, right? And of course, they don't seem to be scalable, Ethereum. I'm just, I don't know. There's a lot of guys out there hovering, circling, you know, around them. And I think they're going to take their place. A lot of other uh, platforms, networks. So again, there you go. Sign up, put the links below in the uh, description and the pinned comment. Read the details, do your own research. This is not financial advice. This is just what I do and how I get yummy passive income each month from the crypto I mine. I do not sell my crypto right now. I'm holding. I'm one of those hodler dudes. Been holding for a long time. Because, again, I sold Ethereum at uh, 1000 So I'm learning. I'm not selling my crypto unless I really need to pay some bills. Because right when I sell it, it seems to quadruple or go 10x, right? Yeah, I learned my lesson on that. But then again, when it goes 10x, think about taking profits, especially with crypto, because it's going to go right back down. The volatility in crypto can be your friend. If you are into trading, but again, no one can time the market. So I don't know. This is the best hedge. And uh, for equities, I do the same approach. I only buy stocks in which I get dividends each quarter or monthly. And this is kind of the same approach where I'll get uh, interest or rewards each month from Voyager. And I get those compounded, roll back in. So say I have Bitcoin when I earned interest on that each month. That interest is in Bitcoin. So it just keeps snowballing. Same with um, basic attention token, Litecoin, uh, and even Voyager, which I hold, which ups my bonus level on the Voyager app. There you go. So uh, that's all you got to do. And uh, you can see right here, the new Voyager gets, as a base referral, you get 50 bucks in Bitcoin. Again, read the details on what you have to do to get that. You got to do the $100 deposit and trade of a hundred dollars or more read the details read the fine print use your brain use your cognitive critical thinking skills uh to me it's been good i've had this for a year i made lots of money each month in passive income even though the price goes down you're still compounding you're getting paid uh the referral bonus the the interest each month in the coin you're holding whether it's ethereum bitcoin or whatever so for me it's bitcoin and i'm just building up my base of bitcoin i'm just Growing that, growing that amount I have, right? And that is my goal. Uh, that is my plan. So I get uh, the new Voyager, that's you. You'll get 50 bucks in Bitcoin. Adventure. Now, if you hold 500 or more of the VGX Voyager token, you'll still get 50 bucks. So it's the same thing, right? Uh, for me, I'm the refer. I get, uh, I'm, at, I'm at the adventure level. So I'm going to get 60 bucks in VGX. So I hold uh, 500 plus more of VGX. And I think VGX is now below one dollar. So when I bought it, it was like three bucks. You know, at five hundred, at three bucks, I got in just to get to the adventure level. Uh, then if I am a five thousand plus VGX holder, I get seventy five bucks in referral. For you to just to sign up, you're getting fifty bucks in Bitcoin. Check it out. Links below. You win, I win, and it gives you an idea how you can actually make passive income on the crypto you're holding. Don't put it all in there. Just put a fraction in there to go and uh, make more little baby Bitcoins or maybe more the uh, crypto you hold, go out and have little baby cryptos, little baby Satoshis, and you come back with a whole family of Satoshis. Because in life, I think a happy man is one with a large family. So I want a large fa a family of Satoshis, right? And in the end, those Satoshis will make me wealthy. And then those little Satoshis can keep growing as well and become wealthy. Right? Does that make sense? I don't know. I'm just babbling. All right. Keep adventuring, Team Voyager. Yeah, I love Voyager. I'm not a big BlockFi fan anymore because they just kept changing stuff, blah, blah, blah. Uh, I know uh, Voyager now has to uh, comply with some of the regulations. And I think that's with um, the stablecoin stuff. So you will also get interest in that. You can go to Voyager, check out their referral rates uh, on the monthly uh, interest reward rates on every coin they hold. They show you each coin is different. And it also depends, again, on what level member you are based on how many Voyager tokens you do hold. So check it out. Thanks for listening. 
I will talk to you later. Go forth. Keep mining, guys. This is the time wealth is made. Stack, 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 stack. Stack those coins, but stack the right coin. Don't be wasting time on uh, raptoriums and stuff like that. It may go well, but no one knows. All I know is Bitcoin is king. I will mine raptorium. I will mine uh, Bitorium. I'll mine the Ghost Rider algorithm. I'll mine the Minotaur X algorithm, but I'm getting paid out. I'm getting paid out in Bitcoin, and that's on Zergpool as well as on Mineable. On Mineable, we'll use the Monero X, uh, Random X algorithm, but I get paid out in Bitcoin as well. Yeah, Bitcoin, guys. That's, that's all I'm saying. All right, I'm out. Take care. Talk to you later.